You know, I met many people who just sit around complaining and make no effort for change, as if complaining is all they need to do to make their world beautiful. I realize that people don't live too long complaining about not eating food. You got to get up and get something, you know? And also, if the children keep seeing this decayed lifestyle, they and their kids will grow up that same way. So ladies and gentlemen, this is a little understanding for those that are always complaining about the ghetto and always complaining about trash and people. You really just complain they ain't doing nothing, so you might as well say, I love the ghetto state of mind. Cause you can smoke on the crowded bus and train lines, sit around and drink beer and wine all the time. And lie to the children about the creator in the sky and watch the fright into their eyes. Break in and rob the passerby to get more money to shout and jive while getting high. I love the ghetto state of mind because the ghetto loves me. I don't have to wash my feet no matter how bad they stink. And I love to go dirty up the beach and destroy plants and trees and break glass in the street for babies' feet. I love the ghetto state of mind. It was good enough before my time. And I don't mind if the babies like to sit around and get high. I like looking at the hungry, dirty little kids while drinking my gin at the bar. I like to go out at night and fight whenever I get a new gun or knife. I love the ghetto state of mind. I like cussing and hollering every damn day where children and old people sit and play. I like to spit on the floor and pee behind the elevator doors like I done 100,000 times before. I love the ghetto state of mind. The lying, the crying, the dying, and living other people's dreams on TV. But the ghetto state of mind is the right one for me. I like going shopping at our ghetto stores where the prices are always higher than the day before. And I like to watch the roaches crawling up and down the walls. If ever I get rich, I shall come back because the ghetto state of mind is where it's at. You, <laughs> and you know that. You can see kids beating each other with baseball bats and big dirty rats chasing little kids and cats. Buildings falling all around and fires are a big event in our town. Seeing the people in their funny nightgowns. And after you finish drinking at the bar, you can stagger drunk down the street to see the Lord. We have a church on every block between the funeral parlor and bar. I love the ghetto state of mind and life because you don't have to be nice you don't have to be right. You don't have to be black or white. Oh my. <laughs> 